Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, I know I have been away for quite some time and that's because I've been <clears throat> obsessing about something else, which is skincare at the moment. So <laughs> I haven't really been paying attention to bags and I know I neglect this channel if I don't have any new handbags. So apologies for that. But today I've actually got a, a new handbag. Um, this is from one of my bag friends and she is the most um bag fairy ish friends <laughs> out there <laughs> because she's got a wide collection and when she's you know um moving around her bags and and switching to something else or whatever i she lets me have first dibs on her stuff so i'm just gonna be filming this with one hand so i apologize for all the movement but she packed lots of tissue paper in here um, as usual, she all she's also um, aware of my skincare obsession for now. So she packed me <laughs> a bunch of samples from from Sephora. Um, I think she, there's also a a sponge there, like a beauty sponge. So thank you, thank you so much. You know who you are if you're watching this video. Thank you. Um, now on to the bag unboxing so let's just dive right in i don't think there's anything else in there okay put the box away and um this bag i actually have never had before i've always wanted one and then i well i've wanted one in a color and i've never found one that's in really good condition they're usually like the, the colored ones are usually faked um, a lot of the time so I have only found good condition fakes which you know what I, I don't want to have that's why I hesitated to get it for forever <laughs> but because oops, but because my friend is purging her bag collection right now she decided to let this one go and Apparently it's hard to get out of the plastic bag. Hang on one second. Alright. That one out of the way. I'm just gonna rip through it like a mad woman. And this is the ta-da! The vintage coach lunch lunchbox bag in navy. Now, I told her from the pictures that she sent me that it looks black. So if you look at if you look at it on screen in the camera, I'm looking at it right now on, on camera, it looks black. But actually in in person, it's a very very dark navy. So, it's all it almost looks like a blavy, a black navy combo. Very very dark navy, which you know what? I don't mind because I have no navy uh, straps around that has the gold hardware so this one has the vintage brass hardware and I only have one that has black I only have a black um, strap that's that might match this one so it's got she even packed the um, T Rose charm that she puts on with this bag which matches very very nicely it this one comes from our other bag friend um, let me unpack all of the packaging so you can see the inside. <coughs> Oops. So inside, it's got that nice um, wide, like big compartment here. It's got the one um, slip pocket at the back. I don't know if I can see if I can show you guys the creed. It there it is. So it's a. Uh, Made in the United States, 1996, style number 9991. Um, this is the lunchbox. It's got a front zip, or not a front zip, sorry, a front slip pocket. And there's no back slip. So this is the back. There's no slip pocket there. There's no feet. So it's a very, very simple bag. You attach the straps to these D-rings on the sides here. And, and that's it. Um, if you guys can remember, I used to have a, I used to, I, I unboxed the quilted lunchbox, the one from the Coach Originals line in Lime, and that one had, I had to return because it was way too small. Like, 
if I put my phone standing up, it was like jutting out of the bag like at least a good maybe inch and a half or so. So it was it wasn't gonna work. And when I put my phone sideways or diagonally, it was just not not good. <laughs> so I think this one is gonna be tall enough if ever I wanna put my phone standing up in front of the in this pocket here, which I typically do anyway. Um Inside, I can even pack like sunglass cases and um, whatever tissues, like just pack it up with whatever crap I have <laughs> and it's going to be enough room. So yeah, it's got that good depth to it. It's not super like, like you know, deep like other bags that, like, that just fat on the side. I don't like that. This one is just perfect. So I think it's going to be um, a good bag. Um, my bag friend said the capacity of this one is like the quartz. So if you have a quart, and if you're wondering if the lunchbox will work for you, um, I think yes. Uh, only if you like zippers, because this is a zip, the quartz uh, turn lock. They both have a top handle, they both have a slip pocket, so you're good to go. You can always wear this bag with this one in front, the back in front. And then have the slip pocket on your side of the on your body side so you can slip your phone without you know getting worried that someone's gonna steal it at least it's closer to your body so it's very versatile that way again um, i've never had this style i think i'm gonna like it based on initial you know initial impressions like the handle is like the um mini the mini willis or willis or min or winnie <laughs> Or the station, like they all have similar handles. So I really like this handle. It's really sturdy, really comfortable to grab. So so yeah, um, I hope you guys like this video. Um, you know, I, I can't promise that I'm going to be um, uploading too, too many bag videos. Um, again, I'm just cutting back on, it's not even cutting back. I'm just not as interested in bags um, at this point in time. I'm mostly focused on skincare. Um, I just realized that, you know, uh, I haven't, I have been neglecting my skin because I've been so busy with kids and I've been, I don't know, I, I think it, there, there was just that time um, between now and the last video I did where I realized, oh, you know, I, I actually have to like pay attention more because now I'm, I'm starting to see fine lines. I don't have wrinkles yet, thank God, but <laughs> but the fine lines and the um, the hyperpigmentation is there, which I never noticed before, but now it kind of bugs me. So so yeah, that's where I am. <laughs> Anyways, if you guys like this video, um, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel. If you guys want to see skincare content and what I've been up to on that side of things, um, let me know down below. And I hope you guys have a great day. See ya. Bye.